Hey everybody, welcome to the channel or welcome back. I'm Carol and I have this spring FabFitFun box. Yay! <laughs> it looks kind of small, doesn't it? I don't, maybe it's just me. I don't know. Probably because the box that came in with my bundle bags is so huge. It's like, guys, this thing, wait, wait, it's still heavy. I don't know what's in those things, but it weighed 19 pounds with this in. I mean, anyways, like I said, thank you for stopping by. Let's get in here, okay? See what we got going on. Okay, well, hmm. there's no info or no, um, <laughs> there's no paper in here. Look. This is what I got going on right now. Let me get it out of here. Okay. I gotta try to remember. I don't remember exactly first, second, third, all the way through, but I do remember this one right here on top. This is by Jonathan Adler. Isn't that a pretty box? And this is the carafe with the glass for the nightstand. This color is so beautiful. It reminds me now, I'm not that old, but I do collect some things, and I love antiques. So, some of you will know exactly what I'm talking about. Remember the colors of the old depression glass? That's what this reminds me of. I have, you know, I collect, a lot of people, most people know this, not everybody, but I collect little tiny shoes of boots, sandals, clogs, <laughs> whatever. And... I have some made out of depression glass, and one is this color, and one is a really pretty gold color. So, anyways, this is what I got here, and this is the tum or the carafe for the nightstand, and this is the lid, which is the cup that's right over top of it. This is cool. At first, when I looked at it just now, I thought, "Oh no, it's defected," but it's not. Look, it's got a little thing there see that it's not I can't even talk right it's the pour a little little spout there y'all so this was on uh, the first round choice I remember that because I mean I tried to my best to get everything that I could get that was not makeup or skincare well, that didn't exactly work out <laughs> the way I planned, but hey, you know what? That's what I like about this box. It's a little bit of everything. Okay. Now, this is also by Jonathan Adler. And this is the set of tumblers. I'm thinking they were 12 ounces. Pretty sure that's what they were. Let me look here real quick. Set of two, blah, 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 blah. Doesn't say on that side. 13 ounce. That's strange. Okay. Well, anyways, I'm not going to pull them both out because they're kind of hard to get out in and out of there. It just took me a second to pull that out. Isn't that pretty, though, that design? And it's got that same kind of color that the carafe and the other glass does. Good size. There we go. So, I mean, not like I needed more glasses, but <laughs> I say that when I order wine tumblers. I'm not a big wine drinker. I, we don't really drink at all much, and if we do, we have a glass of wine once in a while, holidays usually. But, okay. You have to excuse me, you guys. I'm a little bit winded. I have bad lungs anyways. And our weather has been so crazy. Yesterday it was like 68 degrees and not a cloud in the sky. It was so, so beautiful. Today is supposed to be like a high of 53. It's cold, nasty looking, and raining and windy out. Okay, anyways. Next we have Vince Camuto. I'm pretty sure this was one of the top choices. Had to be somewhere around there. I'm just going to get it on now the plastic bag here. It's in a couple plastic bags actually. A little tiny one there. Okay, now this is kind of like 
the extension. You can put on any of these if you wanted to, to tighten it up. I did that when I got the um, jewelry subscription a while back. On Now this has got a little plastic like bag. <laughs> bag. Okay, whatever you want to call it. I'm having trouble with it, so I'm not going to fool with it. But this side is just says Vince Camuto, and this has a cute little stone in there, a little crystal. Adorable. I'm not really into uh, gold, but I've been getting a lot of gold lately. And I've been buying a lot of cheap jewelry. I love cheap jewelry. <laughs> okay. I'm going to have a hard time keeping this if my sister wants it because it's got the blues in it. And her birthday is in September. So her birthstone is sapphire. And this is so pretty. I'm going to, I have to explain it to you before I tell you, show you. At the top, it's got clear crystals, then light blue crystals, almost like a, like a blue topaz or something. And uh, kind of like what's in my earrings. <laughs> Cheap jewelry here. <laughs> and then there's a, the dark blue, which is like the sapphire. And on each side, there's teeny tiny little clear crystals. So let me show you. I hope you can see it good. It's just, the light is just dancing off of it like crazy. But see there, you can see the ridges. Those are the little crystals. There's the different colors. Oh, yeah. It's gorgeous. I just love it, you guys. And I love Vince Camuto. I wear his perfume. And I love it because it stays on forever. And it's not uh, ex really expensive. It's not. Um, so, I have a huge bottle in there. I gave, I gave a bottle to somebody. And I can't remember who it was. And I liked it so much, I rebought it for myself. <laughs> well, I had bought it for myself and I gave it as a gift. But I repurchased it because I wanted it that bad. Okay, anyway. <laughs> now, this next one here. I can't remember what choice. It's called Sprinkles. And these are the set of 12 silicone baking cups. These are for cupcakes. I like it because it's got this little... You know, they're, they're so flimsy, so funny. Look at that. But you can wash these in the dishwasher. But me, I'll put them right down there and just... <laughs> Every time I think of my brother-in-law, I swear I do. I, and I say this often in my videos. If my brother-in-law was here, he'd be going, how'd it go, Carol? <laughs> and I think of him every time I make a sound like that. Because he would definitely... And I'll be surprised when he's my sister sees this, she'll tell him, or if he sees it with her, he'll call me up and say, Hey, Carol, how'd that sound go again? <laughs> okay, I am stoked over this. Now, I did say, I tried to stay away from makeup, but I made an exception. Up, I'm, up, I made an exception. For Pat McGrath Labs. I'm so excited. Look at this out. That is so cool. This reminds me of like, um, oh, look at that. Huh. Okay. This reminds me of like the way it's made and like Asian stuff. I love that kind of stuff. A little paper in there. Ooh. Look. There was two kinds. I wanted them both. I tried to get them both. I picked one and I tried to add the other one on. And they told me like that quick, they were sold out. And I was like, ah. The other one, I think, was just a little bit, either a little bit lighter or a little bit darker than this one. I can't remember. But, um, <laughs> right after that, I watched a friend of mine do a live picking, building her box, you know. And they were both still on there. They just didn't want to let me have two. If you're watching this and you got two, please let me know. Because I want to know if they done me dirty. <laughs> okay, look. There's the lips. Somebody tried to copy this a while back. I remember because we got some, um, I don't know, I don't want to say the name, but we got one in another little box and it had the little lips and it's like, mm hmm Okay, so this one is in the color um, Soft Porn. Ooh. And this is right up my alley. Right up my tree, Stacy Notanoki. <laughs> okay, so see... This is something that I could wear every day. 
I'm going to swatch it. <laughs> or else I will never, ever wear it. But, um, oh, yeah, very pretty. Look at that, guys. Isn't that pretty? I didn't, I just went real light on it. But there we go. I have something on my lips now. Smeared eyes. I bet I look like a raccoon. I What I see when I'm looking in there is a raccoon. Because I just kind of, I didn't even use makeup remover. I used wipes, just wet wipes <laughs> to go around there. So, yeah, this was a choice, and I so wanted both, but oh well. Hey, no need to be greedy. I can just hope to get it another time. <laughs> I was going to say, I hope I'll just buy it, but no. They would be like, have you lost your mind? <laughs> Not because it's so much, just because I just don't need it. It's something else I don't need. Okay. Now, this was um, in a, it was like the last choice, like choice number six. I know that because it was a group, you know, like a little bundle thing. And let's see, we got a, some kind of soap here. This is from Erno Laszlo. Um... The famous black soap. I love black soap. I do. Sea mud deep cleansing bar. Not for your average, not your average cleansing bar. Okay. It has no smell to it. I tried to sniff it and it, it has no smell. And that's great. That's great. I don't, I don't need to have that strong scented stuff, you know. Now, I love my sponge gels and all that, so I'm just, like, talking in a circle, I guess. <laughs> okay, I got this one, and then, ooh, Minted Blacker the Berry. This is Liquid Lip. I don't know if this was, uh, if it's, I'm just trying to see if it's um, a matte or just, Okay, that's pretty too. It's darker. Looks darker in the light there that I see than it does up close. When I'm looking up close here, it looks lighter. Let's see here. Let's see, I don't like the way that looks. I always think that something's old when it's caked up around there like that. You see what I'm saying? I don't think that should be like that. Do you guys agree? Or is it just me? Now it doesn't it doesn't stink. But it doesn't, and doesn't, it just doesn't look, it doesn't look fresh at all. Look at that. Now it's caked all around there, you guys. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and swatch it, but I'm sure I won't be using it. And I'm not going to ask you to use it either. I'll probably just toss it. That's too bad. It's really a pretty color. I like a, a nice dark berried lip. Occasionally. Especially if it's matte, because then I can tap on something lighter. See there? That's a really pretty color. You know, I, once in a while, I like a dark lip. You've seen me wear it. Okay. I don't know. Oh, it's I can already see it drying down. See, now that one it actually smells pretty decent, but it just looks gross. Do you guys think it looks old? Let me know, please, because I, I really, I, I'm not a professional about stuff like this. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, now we have uh, Earth Harbor's Azure. Azure or Azure? Regenerative Neck Cream. Oh, praise the Lord. <laughs> I need something for this neck. I was trying to take a selfie earlier, and and even when I was talking, I was FaceTiming with my cousin, and I was like, this is all balled up, and it looked like I had a fat, flobby, flabby neck. <laughs> okay. I hope that's just from moving around in the box. Can you see that on the lid? It's kind of looks like it's scuffed. And there's no safety seal. Oh my goodness, it smells good. Oh, wow. <laughs> so stupid. If you got this, let me know if yours had a safety seal. It looks like it should have one. I mean, honestly, when, what do you want, girl? Because <laughs> she 
has to always look. She climbs up. She's like a little billy goat, I swear. She's she's sitting on my chest. What are you doing, Gail? Oh, no. You surprise attacked Mommy there. Um, okay, she made me lose my... She made me lose my attention span there. Okay, now I'm just making a mess. This is not a makeup remover, so look what I'm doing. All right, never mind. Okay, so, the, yeah, the flabby neck. I hope this works. And let me know if you got a safety seal. <laughs> then we got a set of these. I have a couple sets of these, and I've never used them, but I need to. And I, I keep saying it. I just haven't been out yet, but I am going to get this cut. Look at that. And... You guys, what what do you think? Should I do the thing where they got the ponytail here and the ponytail? I mean, if I want to cut a foot off, if I just take like four or six inches, they have room to fix it if I mess it up, right? And I got lots of hair clips. In case one side's up there, here, one's in here. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. And next we got here, this was one of the things that I added on because I just... I, I use this stuff. Me and Dave like to cook together. <laughs> and these are the old fruit, like the fruit things. <laughs> Ceramic Katie Kime. What are they called? Uh, raspberry colanders. No, berry colanders. Jeez, Carol. <laughs> Got the glasses on. I still can't read. Oh, yes, it's all smudged up. I look like crazy because well I, my eyes were bothering me and this or that's dry is almost healed up but right here in the corner it's still dried it was all the way across right right about where my crease is at there I'm pretty sure it was from rubbing my eyes but I don't have any known allergies like to animals or anything but my cat is in here in the winter time and he sleeps right on top of me I mean I wake up like sweating seriously <laughs> look aren't they nice now this is something i would use this during preparation or for short time short term storage it's got the little holes you know so your fruits and berries or whatever you want to put in it can breathe uh, but i would definitely put like a little i call them shower caps <laughs> i tell dave honey get me a shower cap for this bowl <laughs> he knows what I'm talking about, too. <laughs> uh, okay. Carol Silly. What time is it? It's past your bedtime. <laughs> oh, I wanted to show you guys this. Yeah, we didn't get any kind of uh, paper. Um, nothing. And I didn't... It wouldn't have been in there anyways. I don't know if anybody wants this. There's 75% off your first box. Plus, your first box ships for free. This is HelloFresh. Um, here, I'll hold it there for a second. Me and Dave finally broke down, and we ordered this. We're on our second week, and so far, we're digging it. Digging it. <laughs> yeah, we, we like it, and we get to pick what we want, and it's so easy. And with me hobbling around here with that stupid cane, okay, this is for bras. Do I need to start ordering my bras online, too? I get my underwear online. I used to get my socks online. Next time I move to bras, they sell that. It wasn't worth my for mine. Okay. Fab Fit Fun and Games. Ultimate prize valued at $10,000 plus. This is, okay, scratch and match. Match four cakes in a row to win. Okay, there's all kinds of ways. Look at that. It's like a lottery ticket, you guys. <laughs> it's sweet. I'm going to keep this out. If I won that, you guys, think <laughs> I would make one more video. <laughs> I'm going on a long vacation, everybody. That's what I would be saying. Okay, so tell me what you guys think. Please let me know. If you guys get this, uh, get the FabFitFun box. Let me know if you happened by chance to get both of those Pat McGrath Labs lipsticks. Because I'm going to be so upset if they cheated me. <laughs> oh, I'm joking. Anyways, you guys, thanks so much for stopping by. Let me share my 
Fab Fit Fun 2023 box with you. Spring 2023. Looking like a raccoon and all. I'm going to go get the rest of this off with makeup remover. But it's been a super long day and it's, it's getting longer by the minute. <laughs> uh, take care of yourself. Take care of each other. And come back and see me, please. Please, one more thing. Thumbs up and subscribe. <laughs> Bye.